Hello everyone, welcome back to Military Now. One of the first women governors in Afghanistan, Salima Mazari, who took up arms to fight the Taliban has reportedly been captured, however, there are no words on her current status. At a time when many Afghan political leaders had fled the country, Salima Mazari stayed on till the surrender of Brock province, when her district of Trahar Kint fell to the Taliban. Reports say the woman leader has been captured by the Taliban after the insurgents gained control over the entire nation and the Afghan leadership, including President Ashraf Ghani, fled the country. A few years ago, Salima Mazari became one of only three women governors Afghanistan ever saw. While a lot of the Afghan provinces crumbled without much of a fight, Salima tried everything to keep Trahar Kint and Balkh province unscathed. The Trahar Kint district, with Salima Mazari as its leader, put up a major fight against the Taliban. Her spirit brushed off on her district and the same showed in their fight against tyrannical forces, determined more than ever to re-establish their emirate. Until the final fall, Trahar Kint was the only region under the control of a woman which did not fall under any of the terror groups in the region, according to The Guardian. Salima Mazari successfully negotiated the surrender of 100 Taliban fighters last year. Over the past few years, Salima Mazari had gained much praise and attention being a woman leader in Afghanistan. Speaking to The Guardian at the start of the latest Taliban onslaught in capturing Afghanistan, Salima Mazari had expressed concerns about the safety of her people. Salima Mazari is an Afghan politician who served as the district governor of Trakhan district in Balkh province in Afghanistan and one of the three women district governors in Afghanistan. Mazari was born in Iran in 1980, a refugee as her family had escaped the Soviet invasion of Afghanistan. She grew up in Iran, earning a degree from the University of Tehran and working for the International Organization for Migration, before returning to Afghanistan. In 2018, she was named district governor of Charkant district in Balkh province. As governor, she formed a security commission to recruit local militias into the fight against the Taliban. In 2020, she negotiated the surrender of over 100 Taliban soldiers in her province. Amid the 2021 Taliban offensive, she refused to flee as several other governors in the country did, with her district putting up significant resistance to the Taliban until the complete collapse of the Islamic Republic of Afghanistan following the fall of Kabul. Hers was one of the few districts in the country to remain unoccupied by the Taliban. On August 18, it was reported that she had been captured by the Taliban.